today we're making our way to Canberra to go to Summonat, which is a massive car event over here in Australia. Which we're going there to check out a whole heap of mullets, probably mustaches, a whole heap of cars being stupid, doing burnouts and stuff. So it should be a pretty fun weekend, but we've got about a two and a half hour drive because I just went to go up to Macquarie Pass, but it's close because there's been an accident, which usually it's usually a truck getting stuck on the U-turn there. It always causes chaos. So we're gonna go up Picton Road. We're gonna be going all the way up the highway. So it should be pretty good. But it's a pretty boring drive now because it's all highway. I was hoping to go up Macquarie Pass because at least it's a little bit bendy and like it changes it up rather than just sitting on a highway. It's pretty boring. But anyway, I should get some pretty good footage of cars doing burnouts and even some of the car shows and stuff. So there's a couple of guys that I know up there. So we'll probably even go around and try and get some of their cars as well. But we'll see how we go. It's not raining up there because there'd be nothing like setting the tent up in the friggin' in the sloppy mud. Because I don't even know what the campsites are because I've only ever went up to Summonats just for a one day pass. This is the first time I've actually went up there to camp and do like well, two and a half days pretty much because I don't get up there until about, uh, about three o'clock. So by the time I get set up and stuff, it'll be good because then we can start getting on the beers and watching the burnouts which were, they've got a pretty good lineup this year they've got someone good tonight which I can't remember I'm gonna have to have a look at the the lineup but I do know Bliss and Esso is playing tomorrow night which I'm pretty keen to see them because they I went and seen them at Waves a fair few years ago and they were freaking awesome it's probably one of the best concerts I've been to but I don't know Post Malone was pretty good as well but they were pretty up there as well, so I'm pretty definitely keen to see them tomorrow night. But we'll get some snacks and we'll get up there and have a look at some nice cars that have had a lot of money spent on them. See a few burnouts and see a few nice cruisers. Alright, went and got me snacks. for the extra drive but got some red rock deli sweet chili chips some low carb friggin salted caramel bar a bundy ginger beer went and brought some sunscreen too because we all know what our red outs are like 20 not even five minutes in the sun and you go red as shit because all we do is just burn and peel 
but anyway back to the driving here we go the view out here it's just too nice not to stop and at least have a look at it but time to hit the road again and get back to it look at all the cars oh i'm so keen for this been waiting all year for it pretty much. Oh, there's a Valian, just like mine. Oh, CL. Oh, check this thing out. Keen. How's it going? Prepaid parking at all for today? I don't, but I've got a camping pass. So yeah. do I still have to pay for... Just show me the camping ticket. Because when you get that ticket, it'll be a pink wristband. Yeah. And that'll allow you to come and go. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've got the camping pass. Yeah, no, that's all I need to see, mate. That's all I need to see. Yep. Oh, so that pays for the parking as well, does it? Yeah. Oh, I, oh cool. If you come in here wearing that pink wristband, I'm not going to charge you parking. Okay, cool. Thanks, champ. How good is that shit? Pay for camping, you don't have to pay for parking. I thought I was going to get hit with another 50 bucks. It's 50 bucks in my pocket for some more piss.